But right now, I want to talk to you about the Arts and Wellbeing Festival. It's at the Chelmsford City Racecourse, 15th and 16th of June. Chris Cousins is in this afternoon to have a chat about this. We're talking about the sort of life arts. And, and who are life arts, for those who haven't heard of it? Well, life arts is effectively um, myself with quite a few, with a number of other people. And uh, been put on events now for, for over 20 years now. It's 22 years. Great. Incredible in that time. Where's it gone? But, yeah. but um, the purpose of this is, is to put on events, festivals, where people can come and and literally be involved and meet a lot of experts in their field which are passionate about what they're doing. And I'm privileged to be in a position whereby I can, I, I've always selected the right exhibitors, the right kind of expe ex speakers. Yeah. Those, doesn't matter how long they've been doing what they've been doing, it's those which are, as I said, passionate, they're, they're in the right kind of ethics, they really know their stuff and yeah. uh, they're willing to share it and uh, to come to these events and give people the opportunity. Uh, yeah, this is going to be, and it is, the largest wellbeing festival of its kind in East Anglia. There's no doubt about it. We've got a 121 stands that will be over that. We've got experts on food, raw foods, wellbeing. Yeah, we've got a uh, whole taking over the VIP marquee and turning that into a yoga studio. Nice. And that is going to be free. Or, you know, you go inside, you pay one fee to come in. Yep. Bring your kids in and that is absolutely free. And the uh, point is, it's there to explore yeah. if you wish to. And and that that's the beauty of it for families. We've got a, a Buddha cave made up there from nice. uh, Chelper's own, own Buddhists who are, are going to be running that. Excellent. Just come in and that teach you just meditation in 15 minutes for free. Because, yeah, and, and I think that's it. The, the important thing is, especially if... You know, if you are really stressed out, and it happens to all of us, you know, I think when not, there's not a single person in this building that no. doesn't have a stressful moment, or you know, um, there's not a person listening now this afternoon that who who hasn't had in the past year a, a hell of a week, maybe a hell of a month, um, and whilst it, whilst you're in the midst of it, it can be really difficult to see the light at the end mm. of the tunnel. Mm. There are mm. there is light at the end of the tunnel. There is way of dealing with it, and every single person's different. I think it's you know we probably didn't even talk about it enough, yes. but yeah. you know what's good for me, you know no. for me is not going to be good for you, Chris. Totally. And, but, and, and, uh, what would totally. You, if if you were, if you suddenly got stressed out mm. tomorrow, mm. what would be your go to, your very first port of call to do, to just to kind of bring it back in and, well, and get it centred again? You know my partner. She's got, I know she's listened to the radio. Mm -hmm. uh, she shares the same name. Yeah, uh, Chris. Funny enough, and people know her as Mrs. Chris. <laughs> um, but you know, hello, Mrs. Chris. Uh, she's very grounded and centred yep. and calming. <laughs> She'll love what I'm saying about that. But um, but it's true. And sometimes I've got someone like that. It really helps. Yep. I'm quite excitable, and I, you know, need to sort of control sometimes my enthusiasm. But that, that's my drive. Um, but I do need to keep my feet on the ground. Let's say Mrs. Chris is busy, mate. Let's say Mrs. Chris yep. is. Um, yeah, okay. Is, is building is, is building an aviary. Yes, um, in the bottom of the garden. Yeah, yes. and and she can't hear you, and you're no. having a right moment. What would be your thing? What would you do? Sometimes that's her personal choice, and I understand that. <laughs> <laughs> so I I actually would just try and sit down quietly, close my eyes, and breathe slowly in and out, just counting to ten in and out. And sometimes just doing that, giving me that window, if it's for thirty seconds, yeah, it you know is just enough. It's just enough. And I think, I think again, that's that's something that I want to sort of make sure, you know, if you're listening to this and you are having a right pick of a Tuesday, because it happens, Tuesdays are pretty non-plus, really, from day, from week to week, but if you are having an absolute stinker of a Tuesday yeah. and you are really up against it, there are a hundred different ways of kind of bringing it back round, getting some logical, like, mind time. Um, it could be sitting there, having a quiet moment, go and grab a coffee, um, go for a walk... You know, if, if you haven't done something, a, a hobby that you really enjoy for a long time, go and just do a taster session somewhere, something for you, and I think you'll find something. Yeah. You'll find a yeah. way of resetting it all. And that's what it is. We need to kind of reboot, reset, yeah. re change the record, whatever it is. Yep. And, um, you know, I must say that this whole event is, is supporting Heather Rollison Cancer Charity, which is based in Hatfield Beverly. Fantastic. And they are absolutely lovely people. They work with complementary therapists, whether yep. you call them alternative or whatever. But, and these are there for the benefit of those which may have cancer, have cancer, and their families and their friends as yep. well. And it's a lovely, lovely charity to support in, in Essex. 
And so, you know, heads up, we, we, we're actually going to be supporting them for the whole weekend. Brilliant. And uh, trying to attract as many people there as possible. And so yeah. we can... And actually, to, to echo a little bit of what you just said there about the fact that it's about it, some of the services are there for the family and friends mm. of those who are suffering through some sort of physical or mental, uh, you know, ailment. It don't feel like because it's not you, you mm. can't get something to mm. do. You know, and, and again, like to list some of the things you've got, you've got yoga, you've yeah. got um, some meditation, you've got some live music uh, at the festival yeah. coming up. You've got NHS health checks, pain relief workshops, mindfulness sessions, meditation, and so on and so forth. Yes. You are as entitled to it because being, being, a, being a shoulder for someone... Yeah can be just as hard work care for the carer yeah absolutely and they have an enormously hard role and it's fine to be british about the whole thing and put on a stiff upper lip don't we ever uh, you know it's fine there's absolutely could do that but then when you have your own moment to deal with it yeah deal with it properly Mm, and mm. you can do so 15th and 16th of june at the chelmsford city race course uh what day what time does it open on both days well this is it we we start at 10 o'clock officially it's 10 o'clock till five yeah both days we are selling um, what we call fast track tickets. So okay. if people want, and they're on sale now for the website. So if people want to come in a little bit early, they can do that, uh, 15 minutes early, cool. and and it really you know can get to see book treatments with a therapist, yeah. and uh, you know come and see someone inside. They they they, re- they have selected because all the details are on the website. Also prior to that, we've actually got early risers yoga as well. So if you nice. if you if you're an early bird, you can come in. Um, and again, have a have a free session of yoga. Um, some wonderful excerpts on hand. We got um, Notley, um, Great Notley uh, Yoga Centre there. Yoga studio there are going to be there all day Brilliant. and all weekend. We've got others too. And the yoga, ten varieties of yoga we've got there. Just on ten, its own. What, ten chair yoga. We've even got ten there. varieties of. Well, that, that's let me say it. There's not even do, ten varieties of yogurt. Do you know there is. There's more than really ten yogurts. Of, of, I'm a huge yeah, yogurt yeah. lover, so you can't really say that. Um, but you can, of course. Chair yoga. Well, chair yoga, and and that's good because I hope that involves an office chair and spinning round because that's my favourite really? thing to do on a chair. Well, yeah. who knows? If you bring your own, you can do that. Who knows? Right, lifearts.co.uk yeah, is the website to find out more about yeah. you, Chris, the work yeah. you've done, Thank you. the work you're going to be doing going yeah. forward, and is that place to go to get tickets? That is the go-to place to get tickets. Um, we've got a link there which will take you through to where we're, where we're selling the tickets yeah brilliant Absolutely. 15th and 16th of june it's a way off but the tickets are available now and they will go quickly chris thanks for coming in you're blessed thank you